He is ready, sisters. Look at the strength. The Night Sisters of Dathomir stand as a captivating and enigmatic presence. Known for their powerful connection to the dark side of the Force and their unique dark magic, they offer a distinctive blend of abilities and attributes rarely seen elsewhere in the galaxy. From their origins and background to their significant roles in Star Wars canon, the Night Sisters' allure lies in their mystery, power, and the harsh world from which they hail. Today I will take a journey to unravel the mysteries of the Night Sisters, exploring their history, powers, and the roles within the Star Wars canon. So strap in and enjoy. The Night Sisters are a mysterious and powerful group of female dark side force users from the Star Wars universe. They are also known as the Dathomir Witches, as their home is the remote and rugged planet of Dathomir, a place filled with dangerous creatures and harsh landscapes. What makes the Night Sisters unique is not their use of the dark magic of the Force, but also their use of dark magic and alchemy, which is often called shadow magic, force magic, or simply magic with a K. They have formed a society where women lead, and their focus is on harnessing their unique powers for various purposes. Unlike other Force users, the Night Sisters merge magic with the Force to create powerful spells and potions, setting them apart from other characters that we may have met before. Life on Dathomir is tough, and it plays a significant role in shaping the Night Sisters. The planet's hostile environment has made them resilient and resourceful. They've learned to survive amidst the perils of their world, and this survival instinct is reflected in their abilities and actions. Historically, the Night Sisters have often been on the fringes of the wider galaxy. They have interacted with various groups, including the Sith, and their history is marked by both alliance and conflict. Over time, they have become known for their skills in manipulation and their formidable dark arts, too, of course. The Night Sisters have a unique relationship with the Force, using it in ways that are very distinct from that of the Jedi or the Sith. They draw on the dark side, but their use of additional dark magics creates a unique blend of powers that are seen as mysterious and formidable by anyone else in the universe. So I think now would be a great time to actually have a look more closely at their powers and abilities and see what they can really do. Your power is no match for my madness. Magic is only an illusion. Number one, their connection with the dark side. The Night Sisters have a deep connection with the dark side of the Force, a powerful and often dangerous energy that flows throughout the universe. Unlike the Jedi who aim to use the Force for good, the Night Sisters harness the dark side for their own purposes. This connection grants them various abilities that are unfamiliar to many other Force-sensitive groups. Number two, magic. One of the most distinct abilities of the Night Sisters is their use of magic, like I said, with a K. This power allows them to perform feats that might seem like magic to others. They can heal wounds, create protective barriers, and even control the minds of others. This skill is a crucial part of their identity and is used with great care. Number three, Spirit Equal. The Night Sisters also use this mysterious substance, which is linked to their magic. They use this glowing green liquid to enhance their powers, helping them perform incredible tasks and create potent spells. It is a physical representation of their deep connection with the dark side of the Force. Number four, their control over creatures. The Night Sisters' connection to the Force does also give them the ability to control various creatures that are native to Dathomir. They can summon and command these creatures, using them to protect themselves and attack their enemies. This skill really does reflect how deep their connection with their home planet is. Number five, limited shapeshifting. In some instances, the Night Sisters have demonstrated limited shapeshifting abilities. While this is not a common skill, it further showcases the extent of their powers and their mastery over the dark side of the Force. And number six, unique combat skills. In addition to their mystical powers, the Night Sisters are also skilled warriors. They are adept in hand to hand combat and are known for their agility and strength. Their combat abilities combined with their unique force powers really do make them formidable opponents for anyone, including the likes of the Jedi. So as you can see, the Night Sisters wield a variety of exceptional powers and abilities, and that's all thanks to their deep connection with the dark side of the force. From being able to control creatures, to using their magic to go as far as being able to raise dead bodies for their cause, they are really awful enemies if you were to come up against them. Seriously, terrifying foes. But with that looked at quickly, 
why not have a look at how they have been used so far in canon? You have failed, Ventress. Surrender. Never! The Night Sisters have been very interesting characters to see, and they've really captivated audiences with their unique traits and abilities. For example, the Night Sisters made their prominent appearance in Star Wars The Clone Wars animated series. Here, their complex characters are intricately woven into the storyline, portraying them as potent and formidable warriors. One particular Night Sister, Asajj Ventress, stands out as one of the most significant figures, allowing viewers to witness firsthand the depth of her dark art skills and her combat abilities. Asajj Ventress initially serves as a Sith apprentice to Dooku, but later returns to her Night Sister roots. It really does reveal more about their customs and traditions. And if anything, she would be a character we would love to see in a live action show as well. Obviously though, if it makes sense to. We also get to see the other central figure of Mother Talzin, the Night Sisters clan leader during the time of the Clone Wars. Mother Talzin's character brings to the foreground the Night Sisters' intelligence, their leadership, and strategic thinking. She is adept at formulating and executing various intricate plans, demonstrating the Night Sisters' skill in maneuvering through the galaxy's challenges and conflicts. With her at the helm, the Night Sisters amplify their presence and significance in the Star Wars canon, showing their capability to influence events and outcomes, showing that really, if they are on your side as allies, they could be so useful. But if they're your enemies, they are something to fear. If you want to look beyond the animated series though, the Night Sisters graced various Star Wars video games too, really just emphasizing what we already know. Players might find themselves facing Night Sisters as adversaries, offering another dimension to explore and understanding their unique powers, nothing that we haven't covered already. What all of this shows though is just how important and impactful the characters of the Night Sisters can be. They're a very unique race and they really deserve enough screen time to fully understand how powerful and dark they can be. And with us now getting more of a sight of them from their appearance in Ahsoka, we might just learn more and more about these people and the horrifying truths behind their powers. He is coming. It reeks of Jedi. So there we have it, the Night Sisters of Dathomir remain a mesmerizing force within the Star Wars universe. Originating from the severe environment of Dathomir, their resilience is matched with a unique blend of dark side connection and arcane magic. Their skills extend beyond mere combat, delving into formidable magics and a deep understanding of the energy surrounding them. To finally see them in live action in the Ahsoka show is great, and let us hope that they are used to their full potential. Like I mentioned, the prominent figures like Asajj Ventress and Mother Talzin embody the Night Sisters' depth of character, revealing their intricate culture and strategic intelligence as seen in various series and video games too. The Night Sisters just possess a great number of capabilities, from commanding mysterious forces to wielding combat skills, and many would argue that they stand unmatched, making them a formidable presence in the Star Wars narrative. They really do hold a unique and captivating place in Star Wars lore, their distinctive powers and roles contributing significantly to the richness of the galaxy far, far away. Their mystery, combined with their diverse abilities, solidifies their standing as an impactful and intriguing group in the expansive Star Wars universe. This video today has really been a brief introduction to just who the Night Sisters are. We could definitely go into more depth and detail about this race. So if you would like to see that, then please let us know that in the comments below. But as for today, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.